This episode was brought to you by Pentester Academy, the leader in online cybersecurity education. Join over 10,000 professionals from 90 countries to learn security online. Also brought to you by Hacker Arsenal, artillery for cyber warriors. Visit us on HackerArsenal.com to check out our latest attack defense gadgets. I'm Marley Oxenholm from Pentester Academy TV, and welcome to our show, The Toolbox, where we showcase the latest and greatest software tools so you can use them to better your security. I have a great tool to show you guys today. Let's take a look at Trape. Trape is a phishing toolkit capable of tracking user actions and stealing credentials. It can also recognize the active web sessions on the victim's browser for popular services. This tool is written in CSS, JavaScript, Python, and HTML. It was developed by Jose Pino and Jonathan Espinoza. Now, you're probably wondering how to use this tool. We'll take a look at this great example. In this demo, we will learn how to launch a phishing attack on the victim to steal his Twitter credentials in real time. First, let's check Trape's help options. Now, we will run the script using uFlag to define the web page URL, which we want to clone. The P flag specifies the port number to be used for hosting the page. Then, in a real scenario, we would need to send a phishing link to the victim using social engineering. Here, we are directly opening the URL in the web browser of the target user. Upon accessing the link, we will get a session on the target user's web browser. We can view and interact with the session using Trape's control panel. We need to navigate to given control panel URL and provide the access key on the login page. We can check the target user's IP address, geolocation, ISP, and system-related information. In addition to that, we can notice the browser of the target user, the Facebook, Twitter, and GitHub sessions are all active. Now, if we can click on a Twitter session button, the victim will be redirected to a Twitter login phishing page. And if the user puts in the details, the tool will capture those and redirect the user to a valid Twitter page. As the user already had an active Twitter session, he will see a logged in view and might not notice the phishing attempt. This demo provides us a peek into the kind of information we leak while visiting a website. It also reminds us that before logging into any website, we should always make sure that the URL is legitimate. Well, that's all the time that I have for you guys today. Thank you for watching, and I hope you enjoyed this tool breakdown. Be sure to tune in next time for another episode of The Toolbox. Also, make sure to subscribe to our YouTube, Twitter, and Facebook so you don't miss out on any of the latest cybersecurity news. This episode is brought to you by Pentester Academy, the leader in online cybersecurity education. Join over 10,000 professionals from 90 countries to learn security online. Also brought to you by Hacker Arsenal, artillery for cyber warriors. Visit us on hackerarsenal.com to check out our latest attack defense gadgets. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time.